Well, we all know that the church is not about the building, it's actually about the people. Well, here at MST at Eastern, we may be two colleges, but we're one vibrant community. I'm studying at both MST and now Eastern. Uh, both colleges offer great flexible learning options that are both grounded in God's Word and also able to be applied in everyday situations. The fun that we had was something that will be forever on my mind. Um, going out to the church and doing uh, simple activities there with the people that um, affirmed what God was doing um, in and through these people. And it also affirmed for me the learning that I had um, here at MST that impacted the experiences that I was having with community, through the churches. Um, that, that was something that, that I really felt important for me. And then coming back to our lodge and sharing um, with the team, uh, just the things that we did, uh, learning from them. Those were the fun things for me. Those were the things that, that I still carry with me. And being part of this community, so it wasn't like I was a student just from MST. I also became a part of this community and, and what was happening there, what, what God was doing in this place. That it's vital that we share our knowledge, that we are not this ivory tower where, we, where the lecturers just lock themselves up in their offices and just do their own research for research sake, which is, well, you see that sometimes, you know that we write essays, we write, we publish in journal papers and they end up on the shelf somewhere in a library maybe and gathering dust and no one's really interested in it. That, that will be very sad. Now what we want to do here at MST Eastern is really making sure that our publications, our, the, the lectures we give, the papers we present, the conferences we hold here at uh, MST Eastern are relevant for the church and that they are really having an impact on real people's real lives and that they are transformative and so, so that is really the goal because the church needs to be equipped and we want to do that well so it, there has to be this connection with academy and church and that's the important bit. one student who had only ridden about only 20 or 50 uh, meters before, had never really ridden a bike, but then he started getting on a bike and uh, through our community, uh, through the cycling group, he was able to start riding and join us for uh, big rides and do some fundraising and charity work and that was really good. A time where we can just um, have a look at the beauty of uh, the top of Mount Buller and God's creation and being a part of that and being able to have this opportunity to do that has been very rewarding and uh, yeah, it's just having that time out also with God um, at those moments um, so that was really special as well. When I started studying I was super nervous. I'd sit in my car and eat my lunch between classes because I didn't want to talk to anyone. Uh, but as I pushed out of my comfort zone, actually joined a local mission trip as a part of my studies uh, and continued to kind of push myself out of my comfort zone, God really challenged me um, and began to transform me in ways that I didn't think um, were possible in my friendships that I was building with people at the college as well as um, what I was learning in the classroom and outside of the classroom and how that grew me and transformed me. So who is the community? Well, it's students, and they've been coming here since the 1920s. And of course, our alumni, who serve across Australia and around the world. We've got prayer partners, and we've got many gracious supporters. And of course, we've got our dedicated staff, our lecturers and our volunteers. This is a great community. It's a Christian community. And we would love for you to join us.